Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I'm going to show you how you can create a mock-up for your clothing brand. So the first thing you want to do is go to photop.com and then the second you want to go to the brand bible. So search it up in Google and once you've done that you want to go to mock-ups and you're going to pick whatever you want to pick. I'm going to use a, a blank hoodie. Uh, click open and it's going to take you to this page and I'm going to use ash grey but yeah if you're using this you just have to go through it and see what you want but I'm going to use this one and I'm going to click download and uh, there you go I have downloaded that one now I'm going to go back and now you want to go to resources again and I'm going to go to fonts now I'm going to click this And now there's heaps of fonts that you can use depending on what one you want to use. It's up to you. But yeah, that's up to you. So I'm going to use this 8-bit because I like the style of this. And I'm going to click download. So now once those two have downloaded or whatever you want to use, which one you're using, it's depending on what style that you're trying to go for. And yeah, you're going to go to photopea.com. And now you want to do that and you want to go to this here and drag that there and then bang that pops up actually I do not want that one I want to go back um, I want to go back here blank hoodies So you just want to go through it and make sure that you are picking the one that you want. So now I've figured out which one I want and it's going to be this one. So I just drag that in again. And now you want to do the font. So how you add the font is pretty simple. You just want to go to text here. And you want to go here. And you want to click load font. And now because I downloaded it, I'm going to go to downloads. And I'm going to click that. And now you want to click OK. And now you can just go to here and find it. And it was called 8 bit, not 9 bit. There it is there. And now to put something on the clothing, you just want to go tax and you want to click here. And now you just want to change the size and you want to change it to whatever color I'm going to go to white and now I'm going to write maybe fade faded and click that and I'm going to click that there make it a bit bigger and click here again and now to make that pop you can go here blending options and you can um, maybe black looks better actually we'll see though we'll go out of glow no maybe not drip shadow or we can stroke it maybe they're stroking it but yeah you just want to mess around with these and see what you like but to be honest, I'm not going to use stroke. I'm just going to go back here and go to color overlay and leave it black. Um, actually, I'm not. I'm going to leave it white. But yeah, depending on what you're doing, just make sure you like the way it looks and click OK. And now I'm going to add like a photo. Maybe I'm going to use a... Now maybe I can go pixel um, stoned character this is just off the top of the head so um yeah it might be coming out it might come out real good or you can just use this copy image and click allow Now we're just going to figure out a spot for it. And 
but yeah, this is just a quick mock up. This is not this is not exactly professional. This is just to show you how you can go ahead and use Photopea. So now I'm going to try to make some shorts. So this is going to be off the top of the head again. Uh, let's go to maybe we'll go here and we'll go to fonts again and click open. And now I'm just going to go through these and to uh, figure out which one I like. And I'm going to go through these. So I'm going to use this one here. And so you just want to click download. And once you've done that, you just want to go to the fonts again, go text and go load font. And now you just want to load that one. And click OK. And go to, I mean, search Friday. And there it is here. So you just want to write that there, change it to whatever color. I'm going to go red maybe. Let's see what that happens here. Oh, you just want to make sure the size is big again. Click that. Uh, sometimes that does that. You just want to go text again. All right, theme on time. And I'm just going to use that as an example. Uh, I'm going to go like that and click Control T, and now I can rotate it. And click that again. And now you, to zoom in, you just click Control Alt and then scroll your wheel in. And now you just want to do that. I'm going to go here and click Blending Options. And I'm going to use a stroke this time. And just make it a little bit bigger maybe make it like a five like that and now i'm going to try to find another character so i'm just going to write demon png cartoon maybe demon i didn't write that properly yeah here we go and let's look at this one here and get copy image And there we go, you just go like that. And now you just want to click Control Alt T, and now you can rotate it. And there we have it. We have a pair of shorts that we just created from scratch. So, yeah, that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe. Thank you. Peace.